this is this video is the explanation of lesson 10 part 10 meri abhilasha hai abhilasha means my wishes It's written by Dwarika Prasad Maheshwari. This is a poem and it is written by Dwarika Prasad Maheshwari. It's regarding my wishes. Okay. <clears throat> Is Kavita Me Seva Tyag Sahan Shilta Dridta Adi Jeevan Mulyo Ko Apnane Ka Sandesh Hai. In this, in this uh, poem, the poet is telling about how to help others, how we have to have the tolerance, so we have to, how the, our earth, earth is tolerating like that. Examples are given, okay. Dridta, Dridta means the, We have to, we have the ability to face how strong, how strong the mountain is like that. Okay. So, all these abilities we have to, we have to include in our human life. That is, that is telling the, uh, that, that is, that he is telling in this, in this, through this poem, the poet is telling. Okay. Now, let us. Let me first introduce, first let me read the poem that, and after that I will explain. First para, Suraj sa damku me chanda sa chamku me jhalmal jhalmal ujwal taro sa damku me meri abhi lasha hai phoolo sa Mehku me vihago sa chehku me gunjip kar van upavan koyal sa kuhaku me meri abhi lasha hai nabse nirmal talu shashi se shital talu dharti se sah sahanush sahi shunta parvat se Dridtalu, meri abhi lasha hai. That means, first para, the poet is telling, he wants to shine like suraj. That means, sun, moon and star. He want to, he wants to shine like a, shine like a, Sun, moon and star. So that means seva. That is a seva. Seva means he want to help others. Now, fulo sa mehku me vihago sa chehku me gunjip kar van upavan koyal sa kuhaku me meri abhilasha hai. In this second paragraph, the poet wants to be a flower and smells nice. Mehaku means smells. He wants to he wants to spread the smell and then good smell. So how the flower smells? Good smells, right? Like that. And vihago means bird. Like a bird, he wants to sing. And uh, in and koel. Koel also is a bird only. So, his wish is to be like a flower, flower and bird in this, in this para. Okay, so that he can help others. Next, nab se nirmal talu. Nab means that is cloud. See how cloud is very quiet and calm and very clean. So, that is Quiet and calm his uh, uh, from that nub, cloud is 
quiet and calm shashi shashi means in the evening it is shitalta it is so cool dharti se dharti means our uh, land earth 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 and parvat parvat means it is mountain mountain is very strong so he want to be a cloud and he want to be a the evening like how the cold winds and all breezing and dharti dharti means earth and the parvat means parvat means mountain mountain so he wanted to be a strong like a mountain so that is sahanshilta so in this poem the poet wants to wants wants to say how the human being should have is how the human beings should uh, behave with others or character character will be like seva seva means helping tyag tyag means we have to sacrifice sahanshilta sahanshilta means tolerance capacity dridhta means we have to be strong and this and all they sh- we should follow in our life life sp- life span okay lifestyle and this is written by dwarika prasad maheshwari written by da- dwarika prasad maheshwari hope this video is useful to you if it is useful to you please like my channel and subscribe my channel thank you